All right. This is like the third try at this one because I had like an issue here and an issue there. <clears throat> so if I just like blah through it, like don't blame me. Like it's my fault, you know. I'm but just blah, you know. Yeah, fuck it. Um, this isn't financial advice, but I hope you do uh, find it somewhat educational, but perhaps entertaining, but definitely not financial advice. I have no training whatsoever. I just kind of throw myself at this shit and like to read about it while I do it, but it's a lot of fun. So, but on the third time, it is it is just irritating. Okay, Bitcoin, leader by market cap at 49k. Um, Ethereum, right there in second place at 1.5. Cardano, occupying the third place play, uh, spot at $1.23. Binance coin at 243 and a three quarters. Tether in fifth place, hold them on. Polkadot 37.22, XRP at 44 cents in seventh place. Litecoin, eighth place, 189.71. Chainlink 29.83 in ninth place. And rounding out the top 10 is $532 for a single Bitcoin cash. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and look at the 24. Pardon me. A little too dank in here. Energy Web Token up 32%. Engine Coin up just under 30%. XEM Coin up uh, 26%. Ocean Protocol 24%. And Basic Attention Token from the Brow Brave Browser up 23%. See that right here. Ba bam. That's my whatever it's called. That's where all my BAT is at. All right. Bitcoin. Winding up to go to 50. God, I said this three times already. Or twice, I guess. <clears throat> what do we got here? Conversion lines above the baseline. They're both looking a little bit flat. Uh, lagging, indicator, lagging indicators pointing down, but they are above some pretty significant support. So maybe we'll see a bounce. Maybe, maybe. And then we got some EMAs there in the correct order. You see a bit of a gap at the upper ones, a little bit compressed at the lower ones. We'll see if that, that actually is a pretty good indicator that we're going to push past 50, but never know. Um, <clears throat> I was saying on the earlier one that, like, I, I tend to think that when I see Bitcoin uh, climb over a, a marker like uh, 50 grand or whatever, and it makes it like a slow, steady climb, it tends to sort of bounce off 50 after that rather than these meteor rises because they have to come down, right? Like... If it just blasts right past the check, me usually falls back through it. Uh, Constellation Network, um, GM4 developed DLT data sharing. Don't know what the hell data DLT is, but um, yeah. Oh well, I guess data sharing standard for autom autonomous vehicles. Well, seeing as how I don't have one of those, I wouldn't know what that is. But yeah, um, this is cool. I was reading about this. This is how they're gonna uh, basically make a standard. So that no matter what car it is, what it gets on the road with autonomous vehicles, it's going to be able to communicate. And the freeways should just flow smoothly because people aren't making stupid decisions. Yeah. All right. The fees on Ethereum are too damn high. And Vitalik is trying to make something happen here. He's trying to... Uh... Hmm. Pardon me. LTTstore.com. He's trying to uh, make... Well, I guess he's trying to make Layer 2 more functional so that more people will use it rather than put all their projects on Layer 1. Um, this is going to be something called a roll-up uh, that lets... <laughs> I gotta be honest, the, voc the vocab is pretty uh, unique to Ethereum, so I don't know exactly what he's talking about But um, in terms of his vocab. But let's just say this. Like, you have a blockchain. <clears throat> he's talking about making side chains that currently don't communicate well amongst each other. So they currently clog up layer one by trying to commun you know, going back to their base, like what they share, their shared uh, language, their shared programming language to communicate. But if you can make them talk amongst each other, then layer one frees up and the uh, incredibly high fees on Ethereum's network go down. I mean, that's as far as I can break this one down for you. Um, still learning more about Ethereum's uh, you know, unique way of doing data. So, okay. Well, good night. <laughs> this one's finally good. I